she's done enough to me. It's beautiful, the talented. Yep. Feet in her face. She said, I asked her if she was good. She said she is good because she got food and drink. And she is good. And we have our I got first. Yeah, yeah. You was up there. I haven't gotten it. Come on. Well, at least it's right. a minute We have our first interview. Hello, and welcome to the Charles City Direct Radio Show. My, my name is E. Digger. My name is Cassandra Murray. Cassandra Murray. Yes, sir. How you doing today? Fine, I can't complain. Ain't no need. I, I listened to a little bit of it. Uh, tell me what was it about, because I was like in and out. I was everywhere in 20 different places. Well, my, my poem was about part of my past. I'm a recovery addict. I had 20 years clean. So everything I said on my poem, it was something I actually went through myself. My poetry is all about things I don't went through personally. I like to make my poems personalized because that's how you really touch people, by being personal, giving your own experience because everybody needs something to hear something somebody else is going through. And, and what was the name of the poem? Mm -hmm. okay. I was lost, and now I'm found. Any other work that you have done? Well, I brought a lot of poetry in my church. I done did. Um, I love doing, you know, taking initials from people's names and writing up their names, writing up some poems and putting them in my church, dropping and stuff. But yeah, I love poetry. And in what church do you attend? I attend Trinity Baptist Church, 1601. Sorry to be so rushed, but this gentleman to your left. No, I was just going to introduce everybody. I know everybody was like looking at you. But, uh, that's Mike Mumbles. Uh, uh, my name is uh, not Mike Mumbles. Today. What, what is your name? Today, my name is Morgan. Morgan. Everybody say hi. No, no, no. Morgan um, Magnus. Here we go. Yeah, Morgan Magnus. Here we go. Morgan Magnus. Everybody say hey. That's my um, 25. And this, young, this lovely young lady right here. And this is on young. I'm the baby. <laughs> this, here's my cocoa with Stemples the Diva. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Are there other areas, um, locations where you perform at? Now, mainly in my church and church and church functions. And how long have you been doing this? I've been doing poetry for years. It's just something that just like when I go through stuff, I like to throw it in words. Okay. My name and I just throw it away. How many poems have you written? I have written many poems. You know I mean? Until they get to the point at church, they ask me, like, doing a cage and they might ask me to write up that occasion and spell it out and give meanings of each word. So do you go church to church or just your church? Inside my church. Okay. okay. I just want to say thank you for coming. Thank you for doing your poetry here. And um, I'd love to talk to you more about your poetry and have you on the show. No problem. This is a I gave you some of my chicken tender. I know. You gave him a chicken tender and you mean nothing? 
You did oh, something. Clearly, let me go back to our very <laughs> first broadcast. Did I? Did I not? I don't remember the first broadcast. I don't. Select the show, and she was like, and I told you don't know what you're doing. 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 Don't know what you're doing.
Like, like, yeah, like, that. Avenue, <laughs> who told you that? <laughs> Kitchen is right out there, order your food, get the drink, get the drinks, dimples and smashing, ain't giving up nothing. I gave up nothing. I gave up tenders and fries. And she dipping yeah. it in the mustard. You getting this, Jerry? It's the good honey mustard. Just right. It's the good honey You gonna go to another break? I just got the cut off point from Mike. We're going to go to another break, but 8 Park Avenue, Tony's Diner, be here. Still, you still got time to come through the door. Do you guys listen to